Hello, my name is Madhu Dali. Today I will be discussing about hydrogen fuel cell system. This system can be used to reduce greenhouse gases. How? So we have to understand how it, it works. So this system is basically divided into two portions, right side portion is the liquidizer portion and the left side portion is the fuel cell portion. How it works? We basically provide DI water with electrolyzer. Electrolyzer basically consumes a DC power that is uh, we can provide either solar power or we can provide wind power. Then it is splits this DI water into oxygen and hydrogen. Then hydrogen will be filtered with the help of this filter, then dry with the help of this desiccant dry, and finally it will be stored into the storage tank. Now this hydrogen can be used to produce power by providing this hydrogen to this fuel cell. Fuel cell basically convert this hydrogen by reacting it with the with the oxygen, and it will basically produce power. And in this case, water will be the byproduct. So we have no carbon in this whole process. Now, how we are gonna uh, run our data? So we are basically uh, coming here to our uh, computer. As you can see, uh, we have different software. So first, we have the Flowagent software. This software is basically uh, used to uh, show us the production and consumption of hydrogen. And this software is basically iPower that basically shows the consumption of power by electrolyzer. And this multicom software basically shows us the storage of power or production of power with the help of fuel cell. Now here, are, here we have different type of the material that we are using. First we have the DI water and then we have desiccant. So this is the fresh desiccant and this is the used one and this is the recycled one. And finally I will show you the uh, results that we have got. So we have this result for the electrolyzer as we are increasing the current. So we are basically uh, getting like more power. Uh, or we are basically consuming more, more power into the electrolyzer. Since we are consuming more power, so we are basically producing the more hydrogen into the electrolyzer. Then fuel cell also shows us a different relation, like this is the relation between as we are increasing the current, so there is like more chance uh, to uh, produce the power because like we are consuming more hydrogen. And for the efficiency, initially efficiency is increasing and finally after some time it decreases. Also, like we can see how this system is basically uh, uh, used to produce the power. So either we can store this power or we can use it for any application. Thank you.